Welcome back to Realize DIY. Today I'm going to show you how to fine tune the water pressure for your reverse osmosis water filtration system. So down underneath the sink, or possibly in the basement, you have this tank for your reverse osmosis system. And this is the case for all reverse osmosis. They'll have a water holding tank. And right down here you see the cap. Hopefully it's easily accessible right on the front, like mine is. You unscrew this cap, and underneath it you have a valve. That's the same kind of valve like you have on your car tires or bike tires. And you do not need to turn off the water or anything for this. You're just going to work on that valve. You don't even need to measure the pressure. So this is really simple. If you want lower water pressure, now if you can't reach that pin right there to let some air out, you can just take any old tool, screwdriver, let some air out. Now will give you some lower water pressure. Check back and forth at the beverage faucet to get the pressure just right that you want. And if you need to increase the water pressure, just take a bike pump, attach that onto the valve. On my system, seems about every three years or so, it needs a little bit more air added to up the water pressure. So you just do that, pump more air in, and check back and forth at the beverage faucet until you get just the right pressure that you want. So increase the pressure, move that and put the cap back on. Now we have the pressure just how we want it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out my other videos on this water system and changing filters.